Drew James here from LearnGuitarInLondon.com and I made a fingerstyle instrumental of 21 Guns by Green Day, kind of easy-ish. Um, you can check that out if you click the link in the video right now. And a lot of people have said, why don't you do a strummed version of that because I'd like to strum and sing it rather than do let the guitar doing the singing, which the fingerstyle instrumental does. So here it is. I'm going to show you how to play it, take you through the chords. You're going to need to grab your capo, stick it on the fifth fret and um, we're all good to get started. We're going to be learning the whole thing, not just that little bit I did there. Let's get started. So this song has quite a few common chords in it. I'm going to teach you the chords. If you know those chords already, you can skip along in the video. I've left a link right now um, and that'll, that'll be there till I've shown you all the chords. So you can start learning the order and the rhythm and my little tips and tricks to make it sound more like the song. Um, you do need to get a capo and put it on the fifth fret of the guitar. The chords you're going to need are A minor, F, as a mini bar or full bar, whatever you're comfortable with, C, G, you're also going to need an E chord, you're going to need an A chord, um, and that's about it really. If you've got all those, then you're all good for the song. So um, A minor, I'm going to show you how to do that. Take your index finger, put it on the first fret. This is all relative to the capo. This is fret zero, fret one, two, and three on the B string. Middle finger on the second fret on the... Um, G string here and ring finger on the second fret on the so middle finger sorry on the D string ring finger on the second fret on the G string if you don't know the names of strings Eddie 8 dynamite good by Eddie E A D G B E strum the bottom five strings for that chord we're then changing to um, I think it's really best if you're a beginner to use a little mini bar F so press down the bottom two strings here with your index finger nice and locked with the finger joint on the first fret middle finger on the second fret on the G and ring finger on the third fret on the D, strum the bottom four, a C is after that, it's similar to this chord, you unlock the index finger joint, so you're pressing down just one string, the first fret on the B string, middle finger on the second fret on the D, and ring finger on the third fret on the A, G, middle finger up here to the second fret on the A string, ring finger on the third fret on the thickest, and pinky finger on the third fret on the thinnest. You can do your G like this, but I think you'll find this G a little bit easier when you're changing chords in this song. It might not be easier if you're not used to using your pinky. Okay, I'll do the other couple of chords as we get to them. So the rhythm. We've got this. Down, miss, 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 down, miss, down. The beginning of the song is A minor, F, G, G, A minor, F, C, G, slowly, so copy that rhythm. get to the G when he when you start singing the rhythm changes to down 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 so I'll do the with a little bit of singing so it's a minor do you for down 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 so the G is always different a minor So when on that part, you see I was holding F for longer, for two. F, F, G, G. You then repeat that progression, A minor. Now on this part, in the song there is no guitar, but I think if you're singing and playing it by yourself there should be a little bit of guitar, otherwise you've got sort of no suspense really. So we're going to be going F, 1, 2, 3, 4, then G, 1, 2, 3, 4, 
Now, did you notice on four of G, I strummed it a lot louder, right? And that's what I'd like you to do because that's what happens in the song. So we go G, then we take a C chord. We strum two down strums. Then we stop the strings with the palm of our hand. So we go C, stop, G, stop, A minor, stop. So practice that with me. Here we go, three, four, C, rest, G, rest, A minor, rest. Guns. Then start strumming all down strums. G, 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 G. La, 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 la. So that's G two three four F two three four. Then C two three four G two three four. Then another G one two three four. So let's do that slowly for your chorus. So we go C stop G stop A minor stop G G. C, 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 G, 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 C, stop, G, stop, A minor, stop, G, 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 F, 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 C, 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 G, 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 then F, C, and G, and hold, two, three, then we're back to another verse. exactly the same thing you're in ruins the same thing then another chorus exactly the same thing as I've just taught you okay in verse 3 when the lyrics turn to did you try to live on your own that's where things are a little bit different so we go a minor as normal with that rhythm that I showed you at the beginning F C with the G down 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 Instead of G at the end, like it has been, it's normally been A minor F C G, it's now A minor F C E major, first fret on the G string, on yeah, the first fret, middle finger on the second fret on the A, ring finger on the second fret on the D. Strum all six strings. Down, 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 up. Then that happens again, A minor. It's an F, didn't I? F, then G. From a stone. Then you've got an instrumental section of chords. I think if you're doing this singer songwriter style, you're probably not going to do that, make that too long. And if you're singing and playing, but I will take you through the order of the chords. It's C, G, A major. Okay, and then you've got another verse, same as normal, and then the outro is just chorus and chorus, one after the other. So we've got And the last chorus you might want to vary, so just keep the strumming going. So you, instead of doing the stops, just keep the beat going. One and two and three. So you just keep it going. C, 